Hello everyone, how to solve this problem for the values of a if we have 3 to the power of a is equals to a and we solve this problem for all the values of a. This is very nice a math exponential equation problem. So I hope so you like this method but if you have any other method in your mind so please don't hesitate to write this method into the comment section. And now we move towards the solution of this problem. So here this is exponential equation uh, so that uh, we have variable appears into the exponent. So uh, here first we need to remove variable from exponents. For this we need to take natural log on both of the sides and when we apply natural log it will be written as log of 3 to the power of a is equals to log of a. And further in the next step we use here the nice logarithmic property you know about that if we have log of x to the power of m is equals to m times of log x according to this rule of logarithm we move the exponent of this term into the front of this log and after moving this uh, before log a it will be written as a times of log 3 is equals to log of a and now here uh, in the next step we need to move the variable terms to the right hand side and the constant term to the left hand side so here we have this is a be the variable term which is lies into the left hand side so here a is multiplied by log 3 when we move it into the right hand side it is divided by log a and after moving this a to the right hand side it will become log of 3 is equal to log of a divided by a so here we use uh, the uh, logarithmic or exponential property and we know about that if we have a number uh, that is uh, a if we focus on this a if we apply log and anti log at the same time on this a it will be written as e to the power of log a because this log and e are cancelled out by each other and we will get here this a only so here according to this property uh, we write this a as in this form we have log of 3 is equals to log of a divided by we write this a as e to the power of log a and now here in the next step uh, we need to move uh, this log a to the upsides and here we know about that if we have 1 over e to the power of x when we move this term to the upsides it will becomes e to the power of minus x according to this uh, uh, Devine property or fraction property of uh, log so we have uh, when we move uh, this term to the upsides it will be written as log of 3 is equals to log of a is multiplied by when we move this term upward it will becomes e to the power of minus log a and further in the next step uh, here uh, we need to apply uh, the nice uh, Lambert w function you know about that this function so a uh, lambert w function is stated as if you have w of x into e to the power of x this is equals to x only so this is this statement basically is called that the lambert w function so we can apply lambert w function on this type of exponential function in which the exponent of e is multiplied by here then uh, we can apply here this Lambert W function. So according to this uh, definition of Lambert W function, you see here the exponent of E is minus log A. So according to this, this minus log A is multiplied by here. But here we have this is positive log A. We need a negative sign. Uh, so that for negative sign, uh, we just uh, multiplying both of the sides by minus 1. So when we multiply both of the sides by minus 1, it will be written as in this form. Uh, so we have uh, this is uh, minus times of log 3 is equals to minus times of log a is multiplied by e to the power of minus log a. 
and now here we are ready to apply the lambda w function so that we apply here uh, this w function on both of the sides and it will be written as w of minus log 3 is equals to uh, this is minus log a is multiplied by e to the power of minus log a and here in the right hand side we also apply this w function so by the definition of this lambda w function the output of this type of function is the exponent of e so the exponent of e is minus log a it means that the output of right hand side will becomes minus times of log a and in the left hand side we have this is w of minus log of 3 so here uh, we need to find the values of a so that's why we need to remove this minus log from right hand side so first we will be multiplying uh, both of the sides by a minus one in order to remove uh, this negative sign okay so when you can multiply it it will be written as minus times of uh, uh, minus log three is equals to log of a so in order to remove this log of a from right hand side we need to take the anti-log on both of the sides so that when we take anti-log it will be written as e to the power of minus w of minus log 3 is equals to e to the power of log a and you see here this log a and e are cancelled out by each other and we will get here uh, e to the power of minus w of minus log 3 is equals to a so this is the value of a this is the required value of a okay uh, but here uh, this value of a uh, is complex value here it means that this a belongs to c it means that this is complex solution of this problem and in other words, we should just say that this question has uh, no real solution. Okay, so this is the, our final answer. And thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos.